When I wake up in the morning I put the sunlight on my eyes When I wake up in the morning I Don't want to deal with customers today It's gonna be a lovely day <laughs> Good day and to everyone. Today is just another uh, day. I'm just feeling this weather. I've been up since 10. My head's been hurting. But I'm walking to work early today because I want to pick up a burger. I feel like a burger. I want a nice juicy, greasy burger. Awesome. But I did spend today as well taking a parcel over to the post office so I can mail out to my friend Katie because it was her birthday last week. And I felt a little bit bad, so I thought, you know what? I'm gonna mail us some goodies. So, did a video on that on TikTok. And now, that should be received with her on Tuesday. Tuesday, yes, Tuesday should be there. So, we're gonna have that. I got work three till nine today, so it's a six hour shift, so it's not bad. I'm somewhat mid-manager today. Even though I look at the schedule to see who I have today, or who is in, I'm just like, they've not really scheduled this out well because you think, hey, we're gonna have this many people on the floor and this many people on register. But I know who I'm working with and I know some people are not gonna be in the great shape of mind for that one. And they're gonna try and be all stroppy about it and I'm just like, I'm one of them. <laughs> But honestly, today has just been that, and as well, a little bit more grinding with Final Fantasy XIV with my second character, so I can be with the team, help them out. I met a friend of mine, she has gotten hungry for this game, and I do not blame her. And already she's like level 41, 42 I think she is now. And that's just like, what the hell? She is horny for this game and she's still yet to play the majority of the story and everything else in between. It's oh, so much. It's interesting as well because, you know, she's already like three steps ahead thinking end game content, what to do, guild houses and everything. I'm just like, there's so much story left. You've only just scratched the surface. I mean, this is stuff in which Level 41 now, and if I'm not mistaken, she's already doing main story quests that are like maybe 25, 30. So she's 10 levels up there. But also as well, she did pre-order Endwalker, so she's got the earring which boosts her XP, so she is pumping out the experiences. Like that. Oh, Jesus. Love it a bit. She's awesome. She's our white mage. White mages are good. Ah. <sighs> But we had situations where it was basically not everyone was in the same world so we can't form a guild together. So we're slowly starting to world transfer over to those worlds. So at least we can all be there as a fam, get a guild going and start something up. But that's the nice thing about it is that we can be, even if it's worth visit, we want to try and make it a more permanent fixture and say, hey, let's be there properly as a fam and help each other out. You never know, maybe more people may be interested to join the game and we can help them out and enjoy it more. Because if everyone from the TARDIS fam was in there, oh boy, that, that would be chaos. That would be total chaos. But also as well, I'm taking back to the store a webcam I bought from the store yesterday because it was kind of shit. Doesn't work that well. So I'm gonna see if I can get my money back on that. But we'll take it a step at a time. Be groovy. But right now, I need a burger. Ah, look at how many cars there. I wonder how many of them are concerned about the Delta variant. Is that, and I will be doing a TikTok video about this, but <laughs> I 
we're like halfway through, well, I would say three quarters of my work shift done. And I want to show you something. I want to show you something very interesting. Are you ready? This right here is a set of keys. One of the manager's set of keys to which I hold on to for the week while they are on vacation. It's very nice. You can tell. It has a nice clip. This is the second set of keys from another manager who's taken their week off for vacation. Now, these are all unpaid vacation times. So, in a total, I'm holding right now in my hand two sets of fucking keys. And it pisses me off because I'm basically running around. And it's funny that uh, the manager who gave me the keys said, all right, I don't need these keys now. I'm off for the week for vacation time. I'm like, well, I've already got a set of keys. I've got so-and-so's keys because they're on vacation. He goes, oh, well, no, they're not back until Monday. So you can have my keys as well. And I'm just like, what the shit? And they're saying, oh, well, you know, I'm taking my week off vacation. It's funny as well because the other manager is taking their week off vacation time. And then the other manager is taking their week off vacation time. So I'll be back and forth playing hot potato with fucking keys. And I just looked at uh, the manager on duty and I looked at the guy who's going on his vacation. I said, oh, so basically then, while all y'all are taking vacation time, you know, for a week, each and every one of you for the next month, I'm basically carrying the store again. I'm going to be the one carrying this motherfucking store. And they just did one of those laughs. Like, ha 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 ha. But they know I'm fucking right. I'm onto their little fucking game. But it's tiring. It is really tiring. It's getting to me. I feel like I'm just being used. Just for them to go on vacation. For them to, you know, have someone on the books to say, Oh yeah, someone's doing the job and stuff. Someone is there as a manager. This is why I'm gonna update my resume. But I gotta go to bed because I gotta be up at six in the morning just to be in work. Eight till one. No. Nope. I think it's eight till one or nine till one. I don't know. Let me look up very quickly before I go to bed. Uh eight till one. And then Tuesday, then Monday, then three till nine as furniture, which I have not had any training in. In the year and a half, I only had the bare minimum training as, you know, furniture person. That is it. It really pisses me off. And I can't do it. I'm going to update my resume. I'm going to call that guy and try and get some sleep. Basically, what I'm saying is if you're going to be a manager, be prepared. They may turn around and fuck you. That's a fun way for this blogist. Anyway, thank you guys for watching today's little video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you as always, hit that like button. But I'll see you guys tomorrow for Brent's Bank in your day. And hopefully it should be better than the rest. So that, take it easy guys. Stop.